Hey friends, how's it going? It's me, your friend Orb. My audio's all fucked up, so give me a second here and let me mess with it real quick. All that stupid itch.io games fuck things up. Anyways, hi friends, how's it going? Tonight we're gonna play Amori, a game I didn't think I was gonna ever play. Uh... <laughs> I've been waiting for this game for like six years. I thought this was going to go the way of Barkley 2. It has had quite the troubled development cycle. And, uh, god, the demo for it came out like two years ago. I think it was supposed to release last year, and then it just didn't. And It's kind of been a mess. <clears throat> but it's out, and I've heard nothing but good things about the game. So I decided to put that bitterness away and give it a try. I hope it's good. <laughs> Rip Barkley 2. But yeah, uh, I guess Amori, uh, was made by Omocat, known for, uh, t-shirts. Um, <laughs> so I don't know what I expected as far as development goes. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, I think there was a notice a while back that they were just like, Barkley's done, no one's working on it. Don't expect it to come out. Uh, which sucks. It's, it's like, of the Kickstarter games that I was, had high hopes for, well, at least one of them got out, I guess. But, it looks really good. It has really great reviews right now on Steam, at least. Uh, for whatever that's worth. Mostly positive. So I thought I'd give it a try and see how it is. It's probably pretty short. Um. Let's see, store page. Overwhelmingly positive. 98% of 782 reviews. A majority of those beginning reviews were people upset about the Kickstarter, which they should have been, <laughs> but... <laughs> Anyways, give me just another second. I'm gonna go get some water. I'll be right back and we'll get started. I got distracted and I forgot about it. Hold on. Alright, alright, alright. Uh, where's game? Here's game. Very tiny window. Let me see if I can fix it real quick. It's like postage stamp size currently. <laughs> Hopefully that can be corrected. And black screen. Hey, this game contains depictions of depression, anxiety, suicide. It may not be suitable for all audiences. I hope you got a chance to be warned. Oh well. I thought I'd pick a real bummer of a game, I guess. Uh... Here we go. Uh, let me relaunch the game real quick so I can read the rest of that disclaimer. Uh, but I, I got it. One second. Time for fun, yeah! That's okay, some of my favorite games are about depression and anxiety. Because I'm about depression and anxiety. It's gone. Sorry, no disclaimer ever again. <laughs> oh well. I hope, I hope it wasn't important. Okay. 
Uh, let me turn it down just a little bit. A little bit, a little bit. Uh, there we go. Sorry. Okay, I won't. Thank you. Huh. Alright, well, maybe the disclaimer was wrong. Welcome to White Space. Oh, okay. Oh, there we go. That seems a little. This game's pretty long. You know what else is pretty long? My attention span. So I skipped out on playing the demo for this. I was so, like, over this game by the time it came out. Uh, hello, cat. Meow? Waiting for something to happen? Oh, okay. A tissue box for wiping away... or your sorrows away. Your sketchbook. Take a look inside. Sure, why not? Oh, nice. A little better. Okay. All right. No, I don't want to look inside anymore. Thanks, though. You booted up your laptop. What do you like to do? Uh, stare at the screen is what I usually do, so we might as well do that for a bit. You stared at the screen. Okay, open my journal. Uh, okay, let me just... Today I spent time in white space. Everything was okay. Alright, pretty good. I guess I'll log off now. The heat from the laptop warmed your lap. It felt nice. I don't know about that. Something fell nearby. Okay. Is it this wiggly hand? Oh, I guess not. <laughs> Overpowered by the music? Uh, mm, I don't know about that. <clears throat> I don't know, the volume levels look pretty good. Got a shiny knife. Oh, can't do much about that. Uh, is there a menu? There we go. Oh, this is cute. A shiny new knife. You can see your reflection in the blade. I found the run button. Oh, well, okay. <laughs> Try this way instead. All right, great. Well, I think we've been in all directions now. A 
white door cast a faint shadow. What would you like to do? Oh, maybe that was the cancel. No, it's open. I'm feeling it's going to be one of those games. <laughs> Turn it down just a little bit. Hi, Amori. We were hoping that you'd come by soon. Want to play cards with us? We're just about to start another game. Oh. Oops. Never mind. <laughs> oh, man. What the heck, Aubrey? You messed up all the cards. I was winning, too. Hey there, Kel. There's no need to get angry. It's just a game after all. Don't give me that, hero. Oh, just like my Gundam wings. You only say that because you were losing. Okay. Yo, I want to check the sounds then. A tentacle's poking out of the ground. Oh, you got stuffed toy. Oh, I guess it's okay. Yeah, this game came out like a couple days ago. Oh, it came out on Christmas, I think. Okay, not there. Guess I'm not allowed to look at the other stuff. Sad poem inflicts sad on a friend or foe. Why is Kel always so mean to me? You know, the other day that good for nothing stole my stuffed toy and hid it somewhere in this room inside a watermelon. Why would he do that? He's so immature. I mean, what did I ever do to him? Oh, I know. Can you find my stuffed toy for me, Amori? Please? Okay, I guess I'll find it for you. Is that? Could it be? Aubrey snatched the stuffed toy from you. Hey, Kel. Look, it's my stuffed toy. W what the heck? Where did you get that? Amori found it. Lucky for me, I've got some real friends. <laughs> Serves you right, Kel. You should know better than to pick on others. But Aubrey started it. She was the one making fun of me for the mole on- What the fuck? On your- What? I don't know, I think you deserved it. Give me the toy back. Aubrey? Fine. Kinda of fucked up. There, there's a movie on TV. Four boys are walking on railroad tracks. Well, that's my favorite movie. The Lost Boys. A fluffy pillow shaped like the head of a girl. Would you like to make toast? Yeah. You made toast. Okay, well, it's been made, I guess. A photo of someone familiar. That's that's a PP. So I guess so. A neatly wrapped present. A blender. Oh, I don't think I can get back to that plant. Oh well. Thank you, Amori. I knew I could count on you. You're the best. No problem. Man, Aubrey always get what she wants. Hey, Amori, I'm glad that's all settled. Those two always seem to be bumping heads. Mari and Basil invited us for a picnic at the playground. Did you want to go see them? Yeah! Alright, everyone. Let's go see Mari and Basil. Basil. Oh, I like this cat hole. A cat-shaped hole. S 
Going out, Amori? Here's your allowance for today. Nice. Can I see my items now? No. Snake band. <laughs> oh yeah, fresh air at last. Gotta love that nature. Well, let's go. Hey, wait a sec. <laughs> Help me, guys, I'm stuck. Only if you say please. Cal, stop messing around and get me out of here. Okay, okay, fine. <laughs> Took you long enough. Whoa! Hey, Steak Spoon, thank you. Well, sorry, princess. I'm doing all right. Let's go up. Do you want to build sandcastles with your friend? Yeah. I do. This isn't really with them. I feel like we're all doing our separate thing, but... Okay. I guess that's alright. Oh, then they're gone. <laughs> Whoa. I guess that's just how it be. Oh! You're afraid of drowning. Yeah. Hold on a second. So tell me, I have I've adjusted the volume a couple times. Can you hear the waves? Can you hear the birds? Right now? Or do I need to adjust it again? I guess I could turn everything back up. And then to just turn the music down. If I can get to the menu. Those sound effects are a tad bit loud too. Me volume. Musical effects. Okay, we'll take that down a little bit. So these, it's definitely, that pop is pretty fucking loud. A little, a little more, a little more, a little more. Okay. Now you hear stuff. Okay, good. It was pretty quiet before, so. Hold on. <laughs> We're still getting there. a little better. <laughs> Can't move on a diagonal, which is a little annoying, but... Can't have everything you want, I guess. Just let me go in this little hole. I can't. I guess I'm on a grid. Where's Pikachu? Uh, uh, right here, baby. You're afraid of spiders. Is there anything I'm not afraid of? afraid of this.
You're not afraid of my father, that's right. You're afraid of heights. Okay. Hi, Percy. I'm definitely afraid of that. <laughs> Yeah, I don't give a heck about them. Mari Basil! I wanna go s check out the other people <laughs> that are far more interesting. This fellow with... a big fluffy pompadour. Oh, hello Aubrey. Hello everyone. How are you all doing today? Kel's being mean to me again. Oh no. Not again. How could he? <laughs> I'm not being mean. Aubrey's just being all whiny. Well, Kel, you've just made a very convincing point. Now I don't know who to believe. Believe me! No, believe me! <sighs> Settle down, you two. Why does it always have to be like this? Chin up, hero. Look at you, being all responsible. I really like that about you. <laughs> Come on, Mari. Not now. Yeah, they've got very similar designs and color palettes, so... <laughs> oh, Hero, you know I'm just teasing. You're so cute when you're all flustered. While we were waiting for you guys, Basil and I were going through this photo album. Wanna join us? Of course. After all, we're the ones in the pictures, aren't we? Basil, Basil, get a load of this! Uh, there is a very explicit, uh... Warning about there being uh, content about depression, anxiety, and suicide in this video game. So, just a heads up if you're joining recently. So, yes, I think that tag might be right. Come on, Basil, take a picture of me. Sorry, Kel. I only take photos of people when they least expect it. You like to take photos of people acting naturally when you're when they're not in front of the camera, right, Basil? Yeah. There's something special about everyone living their own lives. Those are the moments I want to capture. So, like, we just have to pretend you're not he there? <laughs> yeah, I guess you can put it that way. Sure, I can do that. Did you want to show us your photo album now, Basil? Uh, okay. But it's nothing amazing. Oh, Basil, stop doubting yourself. I'm sure that'd be great. <laughs> You're right, Aubrey. Sorry. I'll try to believe in myself more. Here. This way we can all see. Give me that milky. <laughs> I wish my hair could be green. Oh well. Oh, there's more. Some toes. Each individual one. Read. I don't know what button is X on the the X box. There we go. Mari is teaching everyone how to make flower crowns. Mori and Kel are holding Mari's example. So pretty. 
Mori and Kel gave up and ran off, but Aubrey and I got the hang of it really fast. Here's still making his flower crown. It's taking him a little while, but he's getting it. You have to admire his persistence. Everyone's eating watermelons. So juicy. Aubrey has some seeds on her face. Maybe someone should tell her. Kel drinking a bottle of milk, his favorite. I shouldn't get too close or he might get my camera wet. Mari and Hiro take a picture of us. Or sorry, Mari had Hiro take a picture of us. Everyone thinks a flower crown really suits me. <laughs> Hiro leaning in for a smooch. Kel looks so annoyed. <sighs> Brotherly love. We're having a picnic today. Mari wanted to take a picture of everyone. Say cheese. After eating, everyone fell asleep except Hiro and Mari. I'm getting kind of sleepy myself. Kel said he took a picture of himself on accident, but I don't believe him. All of our feet in a circle. Can you guess whose feet are whose? Yeah, whose feet are whose? Feet expert. These photos are also charming, Basil. You really know how to capture the moment. <laughs> Thanks. I didn't take all of them, though. Mari likes to steal my camera sometimes. O only sometimes. Hey, I have an idea. Did you all want to come hang out at my house? I just finished planting some sprouts and wanted to show everyone. Come on, they're really cute. Yeah, sure, that sounds like fun. Let's go! It's south of the playground, right? Yep, that's the way. You don't want that candy. Is some you gonna leave that there? Hmm. I think I'll sit this one out. You all go and enjoy yourselves. But if you're ever feeling weary, you can always stop uh, by one of my picnics. I'll always have some refreshments ready. And you can even save using my picnic basket. Whoa. Ah, thanks, Mari. You're always doing so much for us. Bye, Mari. We'll see you again soon. <laughs> Run along and have fun now. You know where to find me. Yes, some nutritious candy. Would you like to eat some? Yeah. You and your friends feel like new. Oh, okay. No boss zone. Violators will be prosecuted. Well. I'm gonna swing to the moon. Nose is my best friend. She can't say much, but she's really smart. Nose looks occupied. Hey Amori, guess what? I got some plans today. Big plans. Just stay put for a while. You'll see what I mean soon enough. Okay. Beryl talks so fast when she's excited. It gets really hard to keep up. Okay. Okay, big plans. Oh! <laughs> hey, wait a second! Where do y'all think you're going? Oh. You can't leave without joining us for a game of hide and seek. Stay and play with us. The more, the merrier. You wanna play hide and seek again? But... You know how this turned out last time. Yeah. Sorry, Beryl. I think we're gonna have to pass. 
Oh, but I want to play hide and seek. Okay. We're going to Basil's house now, so... We'll catch up with you later. Not so fast. You guys trying to avoid me again? What's up with you two? Is it my face? My rough and tough exterior? At least I'm not as bad as Boss. It's a good thing I banned him from the playground after what happened last time. I wonder what ha uh, what that moron is up to now. Eh, good riddance. Uh, so, you want to play hide-and-seek, Basil? I can go either way. There's no rush to get to my house after all. I think I'll leave it up to Amori. What do you want to do? Amori, Amori, my best friend. Come on. You know you want to play hide-and-seek, don't you? Okay, I guess I do. <laughs> That's what I thought. What's stopping you then? Come on, let's play. I'll round everyone up. Ten hut. Want six hot loads. All right, maggots. Here's the rules. We're gonna be entertaining ourselves with a little game of hide and seek. Here are my hands. I got some straws. See, everyone here's gotta pick a straw. The one with the shortest straws gonna gonna be it, and we'll have to find everyone else. Sounds easy enough, right? We all got our straws? Good. I didn't get to talk to this tall fella, so I don't know what their name is. Now, let's see who's gonna be it. Well, well, well. Looks like the one with the shortest straw is... Amori. Oh wait, Amori is it? But Amori doesn't like to be alone. Are you gonna be okay, Amori? I can take your place if you want. I don't mind, really. Hey, I hear you plotting over there. The straws make the rules, not me. Come on, don't be babies. It ain't so bad. Amori will be fine. When you're ready to play, walk up to the tether ball pole and close your eyes. And no peeking, or else. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. Can I even hide anywhere around here? I'll try my best. Okay. Uh, I feel so sleepy. Yay, it's time to play! Uh, I don't even know where to hide. I'm not creative at all. Alright. Okay, oh, I, f I found one person. Whoa, you found me! Now I can help you find everyone. Just don't tell Beryl about this, got it? <laughs> okay... Oh, you found me! Darn. Let's go find everyone else together, Amori. Huh? Where am I? Uh... I was dreaming that I was on a private beach with servants fanning me with a palm tree leaf on every side when suddenly... Wham! And now I'm here. I must have fallen asleep while hiding. I guess that's game over for me. <laughs> Got him. Oh yo, does anyone want this banana? Eternal banana. that the eggs have nice squishy sounds. Oh yeah, video game. No, uh, turns out there's not many places to hide here for a guy my size. But this was still fun. 
As long as Beryl's happy, I'm happy. Nose goes. Shh, if you're too loud, they'll hear us. Nose goes, bun goes. Be quiet, nose. We're hiding, remember? Aha, we found you and bun, you bun and nose. Nose, they found us. Nose goes. Oh, you know I can't stay mad at you. Let's go play patty cake. Darn, you found me. I guess that means I lose. You know what Happy would say right now? She'd say something like, Bangs, you should try your best at everything. How else will people see how awesome you are? Next time, I guess. Spot. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, hey guys. You know, I found a really good hiding spot, but Sean and Rin invited me to join them in their exercise routine. It's fun and good for you. You guys should really try this. It's uh, really. I'll work out. Hold on, my phone's fucking going off because it's 12.30, it's game time. I didn't want to miss it. I gotta find it, though. Where could it be? Why, it's in my pocket. Mystery solved. Oh, man, I'm so tired. Wow. You really don't know how to say no to anyone, do you, Hero? Come on, Hero, we gotta help Amori find everyone else. All right, all right. I'm coming. Bye, Sean. Bye, Rin. This was fun. Yeah, let's do it again sometime. See you later, Hero. Oh, yeah, what's that? Boing, it's me, Happy. You found me, so that means I gotta do something else now. Oh, I know. I'm gonna count the alphabet backwards. Z. Y. X. W. V. U. O. M. Um. O. It seems. Uh. <laughs> A suspicious blue mailbox. Whisper, 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 whisper. You probably shouldn't disturb this. Okay. There's a straw in the ground. Pull it out? Yep. Took you guys long enough. I thought I was gonna suffocate in there. How do you like my hiding spot? Pretty good. It looks like you pretty much found everyone else too. Unexpected, but I like it. Let's do a final roll call. In hut. Van. Here as always, buddy. Charlene. Here. Mick Mickle. Zzz. What the fuck? Now what gives? Happy. Here, here. 
Browse. Ah! Bangs. Here. Bun. Bun is here. Nose. Nose goes. Hero? <laughs> Present. <laughs> Kel. <sighs> you really gotta do this every time, Barrel. Hey, well, that was uncalled for. Aubrey. Here I am. Huh? Where's Basil? Uh, that's strange. I thought I saw him going near that tree over there. Basil, where are you? Can you hear us? Basil! You can come out now! You already won! Hello, Basil! Hey, there's Basil. Basil, are you okay? Are... are you stuck? Oh, heck. <laughs> Boss, I should have known it was you. You good-for-nothing scoundrel, let Basil go. Yeah, what did Basil ever do to you? Basil's our friend. Don't you dare hurt him. Let go of Basil, boss. He didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> you stupid heads. You think this is about Basil? Don't play dumb. You know why I'm here. You dare not invite me to hide and seek? Or sorry, how dare? I'm the one who showed you all how to play in the first place. You're not even playing it right. How can you call it hide and seek without any body slamming? <laughs> My flower crown. Hey, that's the flower crown we made for Basil. Basil. We need to decide soon on how we're going to say this. <laughs> how could you? You let go of him, you bully. No. If I can't play with everyone, then no one can. This is a boss-only zone now. And you're not invited. Keep changing? Okay, well... <laughs> What will Amori friends do? I guess we'll run away. Uh, let me look at my... It's time for a sad poem. It's gonna cost me five tears, though. X to switch sides. Oh. That's not the X button on this controller. Well, <laughs> let's see, pep talk, makes a friend or foe happy. Might as well try it out, huh? Let's see, annoy, makes a friend or foe angry. We have no toys. Cook. Heals a friend for 75% of their heart. Can be used outside of battle. Cost 10. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> Is there... Maybe not.
combat happened so quickly that I'm not really sure what in you- 17? He weaklings. You call that an attack? Whoa. Try angry. Sorry, I'm trying to think of where. I... There we go. <laughs> I think that increased how much damage they did. Or took. It's hard to tell. The game hasn't explained anything yet, so. This isn't fun anymore. Time for my special move. Body slam. Oh, <laughs> dead. Oh, that's fortunate. Huh? How are you still moving? Oh. Nice, nice whiff. We'll try again. Okay, I guess it's time to run away. Now I understand sad, at least. The other effects, not so clear. This isn't fair! Rematch! I want a rematch. Whoa. Basil, are you hurt? <laughs> Don't worry about me. I'm just fine. Boss? It must hurt to see people have fun without you. But that doesn't mean you can ruin other people's fun. Hmm. <laughs> I know that. There. Does that feel better? Basil... Are you sure it's okay to do that? Boss is bad news! It's a good thing Amori held on during that final attack or else we all would have been toast. It's okay, I trust him. When you were all fighting, he tried really hard to make sure I didn't get hurt. Is that true, boss? Hmm. <laughs> That's a load of baloney. I don't need to hear these lies. This is my spot. No one's welcome here. Okay. Well, 
He probably won't be... Or, he probably won't be a problem as long as he stays like that. I guess that means we can go to Basil's house now. <laughs> that sounds good to me. We're leaving now, boss. Don't cause any trouble, okay? Okay, I'm ready. Let's go. Hold on, get her some fucking candy. Mm. You and your friends feel like new. Okay, and safe too. Oh, okay. Fine. Yeah, we can we can go see that shit later. <laughs> okay, I guess we can. Yeah, let me let's go look at some fucking sprouts, I guess. Wow, so cool. Psst. Hey. Psst. You. Yeah, you over there. Um, Mori, I think that mailbox is talking to us. Maybe we should go check it out. Okay. Yes, yes, hello, valued customer, welcome to my shop. Please buy something, kick, kick, kick. Okay, what do you got? Uh, deal small damage to all foes and reduces their speed. Flex anger on a friend or foe. Heals juice. Candy. 30 heart. Okay. I'm gonna. Oh, it's the same dialogue. Train station, Pinwheel Forest, Basil's house. And these are sunflowers. They're called that because they always face towards the sun. That's how I want to be like. Someone who always sees the bright side of things. Oh, okay. A watering can. These flowers are called Lily of the Valley. It's said that they're able to ward off evil spirits and help people see a brighter future. I guess that's why they remind me of Mari. I can always count on her to help me stay positive. Whoa. What's that ugly plant creature? Don't you know, Kel? That's a sprout mole. Sprout moles are highly intelligent creatures, but become dangerously vicious when they're lost. Please, Mr. Sprout Mole, stop that! You're stomping all over the flowers! I guess the only thing we can do is kill them. Like us, Sprout Moles also feel emotions. Since this Sprout Mole is angry, its attack is higher. But on the other hand, it lowers its defense. Okay. So what you're saying is now is the perfect time to strike. Okay. Sure. calmed him by murdering him. <laughs> Most of the flowers are unharmed. That's a relief. Hey, Amori. Now that we're getting the hang of battling, 
Here's a journal where we can keep track of any neat foes we come across. Oh man, faux facts. There, now it's in your pocket. The journal is yours to record with, but we might pitch in sometimes too. Check it through your pocket in the player menu by pressing B. Okay. Important. Faux facts. Use. There it is. Cute. Wow, there's a number of foes that can show up. Boss. Type of flower called the glad gladiolus. Glad the gladi what? Gladiolus, also known as the sword flower. <laughs> as you might have guessed, they represent strength of character, someone who's honest with strong moral values, someone who stands by their convictions. The gladiolus reminds me of Aubrey because she's always true to herself. Oh, I see. So what you're saying is that Aubrey is really stubborn. No, I'm not. <laughs> okay, let's move on. These are roses. Can you guess who they remind me of? <laughs> they remind me of Hero. Did you guess correctly? Roses come in many different colors and have their own unique meanings. Pink roses symbolize admiration, orange roses symbolize passion, yellow roses symbolize friendship, and the list goes on. Hero doesn't remind me of any of, the, of any rose in particular. I think Hero is like all roses, because he's versatile and universally loved. Oh no, not again. Mr. Sprout Mole, stop twirling. You're destroying all the flowers. Oh god, no, he's twirling. Oh, I see. This sprout mole is happy. In that case, it has a higher chance to hit our weak spots and do more damage. This also means that it has a higher chance of missing. Oh. <laughs> yeah, happy sounds just like a safer angry. <laughs> but maybe not. <laughs> iffy about the battle system so far, but we'll see. Hmm. We seem to be running across a lot of foes with emotion. In case you didn't know, emotions can determine how strong or weak an attack is. Happy beats angry. Angry beats sad. And sad beats happy. Boy, it sure do. Here, I even drew up a guide on how they work. I'm no artist, but I think you'll get the point. I'll put it in your pocket so you can check it out later. I I'd like to look at it now, yeah. <laughs> Some damage to heart juice. Defense up, speed down. Okay.
Whoa, what are these flowers called? They're co all cool and spiky. Actually, Kel, this is a cactus. It's more of a plant than a flower. And it's funny that you ask because they remind me of you. Is it because he's a prick? <laughs> hey! <laughs> well, that too, but mostly because cacti are very sturdy and resilient plants by nature. They don't need much care and can survive even in seemingly impossible conditions. I guess what I'm saying is that even you could take care of a cactus, Kel. Whoa, neat. Cacti are awesome. Uh, these are white tulips. Plain, simple, and bulbous. Just like a mori. <laughs> I don't know. I just think it's cute. You're bulbous. <sighs> Not another sprout mole. It's all good, Basil. We got the hang of this by now. That means it won't do as much damage as normal, but also take less damage to heart and lose juice instead. How sad. Let's put it out of its misery! We could use angry, but I think I'm gonna hit it till it dies. Oh, it takes no damage. <laughs> to make it even sadder. Can't get sadder. It's the saddest it'll ever be. Stabbed it in the heart and it died. Oh, massage. Hi everyone, you all came just in time for a lovely picnic. Feel free to rest here. Everything's already set up, and they even brought some fruit. I guess fruit's okay. Mmm, delicious fruits. A munch, munch, munch. Woohoo, thanks Mari, you're the best. Oh, it's nothing. I'm just trying to look out for all of you. Oh, Mari, I wish I could be more like you. You always seem to have everything under control. That's not uh, true at all. It just seems that way from the outside. Either way, you sure seem to make everything look easy. Yes, I agree. Mari's so effortlessly graceful. Oh, <laughs> I can say no. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Don't you think so, Mori? <laughs> yeah. Aw. I guess I have to believe it a little bit if all of you think so. 
my house is right down this way. Are we all ready to go? No, let me fucking save. I'm ready when you are. We'll catch you later, Mari. Let me know if you need anything. See you soon. Scary. <clears throat> it's probably nothing. Oh. Rolls of oh. Okay, didn't do that much less damage. Oh man, this fight is pretty tough. But don't worry, we can do it if we work together. Looks like I'm gonna have to teach you all a little bit about teamwork. Let's try again, Amori. We'll get him this time. Okay. Have you noticed anything different, Amori? You should see a new bar at the bottom of the screen with a number on the side. This is our collective energy. By using our energy, we can defeat this foe together. Just attack and you'll see. Okay. I will just attack. Do you see the bubbles that popped up when we attacked? That's called a follow-up. After you attack for a limited time, you can use energy to perform a follow-up move. You just press any directional arrow and see what happens. Well, I did during it, but... It <laughs> I, guess, I guess we get to try it for real this time. I wonder why I didn't get that one. Yeah. Man, this guy's really tough. When he attacked us, did you notice our energy went up? When we take damage, we also gain energy. Think of it as a chance to make a comeback. Oh, I think... Okay, so it has to be already highlighted to be able to select it. Maybe. Nice, we're full of energy. This is the perfect time to use our special attack. Mori. After you attack, press to release energy. Okay. 
Yeah, it feels like this whole section is pretty scripted. There we go. Super dead now. I learned stab. <laughs> and there you have it. Heroes Battle Tutorial 101. And I'm sure that as we fight more battles, our teamwork will improve over time. Wow, you guys. That was so amazing. Yeah, it was nothing. I've taken down way bigger guys than that. I should teach you some of my skills one of these days. Basil, I know you're not the type that likes to fight. But it's good to know how to defend yourself too. You know, I've actually been working on a book all about battles. Maybe we can all study together next time. I'll give it to Amori to hold on for now. Another fucking book! You got the self-help guide. As we get stronger, I'll be updating the follow-up section of the self-help guide. So be sure to check it out every now and then. Amori, you should know. When we gain experience and level up, sometimes we'll also learn skills. Skills are powerful and have a wide range of effects, but each of us can only remember up to four skills at a time. After you learn a new skill, don't forget to equip it from the player menu, okay? Yeah, yeah, we know. Can we go to Basil's house now? Okay, that's all I had to say. Patience, Kel. Oh man, let's go inside the house in a second because I'll be right back. I'm gonna get some more water. Hold on. Hi friends, I'm back. I'm well hydrated and well supplemented, and you can be too. If you type exclamation marks up, you can find out how. <sighs> Hold on. Video game? There it is. Oh 
What was I doing? Oh, I gotta equip my skills so I can stab people. Uh, did it auto-equip my stab? It auto-equipped my stab. Okay, so if I don't have anything, it'll do it. Guard? How useless. Looks like everyone gets it. Massage. Removes a friend or foe's emotion. Okay. Hmm. Okay. It's a nice house. <laughs> Say cheese. I wasn't ready. Everyone's in a line. How are you gonna get a picture of them? Oh well. Oh, it came out kind of blurry. Well, that's okay. That gives a character. Hope you don't mind the photo. <laughs> of course we don't mind. I want to see it. Oh, sh sure thing. We all look so cute. Uh, how's my hair? I want to see! I want to see! I will say nothing and stand in the background. Oh, hey, Amori! Did you want to look at the photo, too? No. <laughs> Sad. It's too bad that it came out kind of blurry, but you all still look so cute. I should add it to my collection. Woohoo, another shot for the photo album. Move over, Aubrey, I can't see. Hey, stop pushing. You already had your turn. Get out of my way, Kel. W wait, hold on. There's no need to fight. Me first. No, me. Oh, it's time for a massage to remove those emotions. Stop it. You guys are knocking me over. Oh! Dot 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 dot. Uh... Whoops. Oh my gosh. Basil. I'm so sorry. Uh, are you okay, Basil? You two are in big trouble now. This is why both of you need to learn how to get along. I'm sorry, we didn't mean it, Hero. Please don't tell Mari. It's okay, don't worry about it. Accidents happen. Here's your photos. It doesn't look like any of them got damaged. Let's put them back in your photo album together. <laughs> Thank you, Hero. Let's go inside my house first. Remember to wipe your feet before you come in. Yeah, what the heck's Mari gonna do? Leave the picnic? I don't think so. Gotta go explore. Oh, um, maybe not over here. A bunch of potted plants and flowers. Basil loves taking care of things. A shoe. Basil's photo album. His most precious belonging. Are you ready to put back the photos, Amori? Yeah. Oh, good. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> Yay, let's get started. I have to remember the order that they were in. Hmm, <laughs> darn. I don't think I remember the order of all these photos. <laughs> don't worry about a thing, Basil. Amori has a really good memory, so I'm sure we'll figure it out in no time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, here we go. I'll figure it out in no time. That, that seems like it goes here. 
Maybe the text beside it will say. Oh well. Oops, I left. Hey, don't look at me. I don't know where the photos go. Oh no. I can't cycle, but maybe I have to select a photo before I try to turn the page. Okay, yeah, there we go. I know this was like here-ish. about right <laughs> sorry about your memories basil <laughs> there good as new I'm really sorry for pushing you over basil even though at least uh, half of it was Kel's fault yeah, I promise to never fight with Aubrey ever again unless she starts it first. <laughs> Don't worry about it. I know you only wanted to see my photo album. Thank you for helping me put it back together. Huh? That's strange. A photo must have been loose. Huh? What is this? <laughs> Did I take this photo? Something about it seems... so familiar. No... that can't be. M Mari! Oh! She's what? What's Mari? She's okay? She's having a picnic? Okay. Well, gonna need some tissues. <laughs> Meow. Not much to do around here, is there? All right, let's get gaming. Stare at the screen for a bit. Okay. Open my journal. See, today I visited my friends. Everything was okay. All right. Yeah, let's look at the sketchbook. Is our friend at the pond. light bulb hangs from the ceiling, wherever it is. Look into the light bulb, I guess I will. It's pitch black inside. You can't see a thing. Hmm. Okay. Or is there? Are you looking for a way out? There's always... There always is one, but... Waiting for something to happen.
can do that, I guess. <laughs> I found my way out. Well... see a boy sleeping in his room. What's his name? I guess his name is Sonny. <laughs> yeah, sure, why not? Joe Nett. <laughs> no thanks. <laughs> Table lamp. Cardboard boxes littered across the house. Mom's to-do list. You don't feel like doing your chores right now. A bunch of books. An old computer. I guess I really need to check that phone, huh? A wardrobe. I want to check out this plant. An ordinary house plant. Nothing special about it. You have one new message. Hey, Sonny, it's Mommy. I'm still in the city setting things up for our new home. Did you finish packing yet? The movers are going to be at our house in a few days, so I left a list of things for you to do before they arrive. Also, sorry, Mommy messed up. I forgot to tell the electric company that we need a few extra days before we're ready to move, so the lights might cut out sometime tonight. Anyway... I know moving to a new place can be a little nerve-wracking right now, but I think a change of scenery will be positive for both of us. I know you haven't talked to anyone in a while, but you might want to say goodbye to your old friends before we leave. Kel has been trying really hard to get a hold of you ever since we put our house up for sale. He's been calling us every week for the past few months. He seems a little lonely. Maybe you should pay him a visit. Okay, that's it for now. Mommy loves you. Bye, honey. Bzz. You're hungry. I guess the phone just stayed powered until that moment, huh? It's family photos, cardboard boxes. A bathtub. Mommy's sticky note. Hi, Sonny. This is a note from Mommy. Remember to brush your teeth every day. Love you, XOXO. Some towels and toiletries. And a toilet. Hold on, I gotta check this one real quick. An ordinary houseplant. Nothing special about it. An empty picnic basket. What do you like to save? Mom's bed. The mattress is too hard for you to sleep comfortably. 
table lamp. Are you sure you want to go downstairs? No? <laughs> Small fake house plant. Hold on, let me let me go explore some more. Okay, I've done the. Ex I didn't look at these family photos. Okay, now I'm good. We can go down now. No. Oh. No. You don't want to look down. feel dizzy. Maybe you can sleep it off. A very comfortable bed. Would you like to go to sleep? Sure. Messages. Oh good, it's light out. An eerie red glow radiates from outside. You feel strangely drawn to it. Oh no, I can't go in mommy's room. Or the bathroom. <laughs> okay. It's okay, the meteor is about to hit. Just some fingies. You're hungry. Okay. Oh, hey, the knife. Yoink. Oh, stabbing's not an option anymore, though. But I still have 30 bucks. Cool. Will Sunny do? <laughs> I think uh, maybe we should run from this one. <laughs> okay, I guess we'll fight. What skills do I have? No skills. Uh, Sunny's attack did nothing. I'm swinging, I guess. scary as you think. You steady yourself and you remember how to calm down. Removes emotions and heals some heart. Alright, now I've calmed down and I'm ready to continue stabbing the darkness. You got a first aid kit. Yeah, I'll probably need that. The bookcase has been cleared out. 
I'm gonna find that special house plant one of these days. Just wanna look at the plant. No, I can't look at these. Okay, I guess that's not the room to go in. Piss spot on the carpet. This way? Um, got a bandage. A bunch of books. I'll get food first, I think. <laughs> you look in the fridge and find cold steak. Hell yeah. You got cold steak. You should probably heat it up before you eat it. Is this my second knife or was it? Got the steak knife. Is that an upgrade to regular knife? No, never mind. <laughs> Mmm, microwave steak, my favorite! Got microwave steak! Gotta let it marinate in a little milk first, though. Ah, oh, yes, a lovely, well done steak. Would you like to eat some? Oh, <laughs> oof. Your stomach didn't agree with that. I guess I have to go back to the bathroom now. Threw up. Let me brush my teeth. Oh, I'll just stare. Never mind. Oh, someone's here. Let me go open the door. Hey, Sonny, it's Mari. I'm finally back home, but I forgot my keys. Could you open the door for me? It's the thirst, thirstiest time of the year. Alright, I think that's enough. We'll close the door now. <laughs> Alright. Dirty dishes. Hold on a second, wait. Let me go back. A fireplace. Their nails stuck between the bricks. Hmm. 
Hmm, I think it's time to go back to bed. for as long as you can remember. Oh, cool. A tissue box? Okay. Let me let me check my my journal. Collect the keys to fill in the blanks. Incorrect keys will be discarded to the right. Oh, okay. Open the hangman menu. Something fell nearby. I guess maybe outside the door, because there doesn't seem to be much in here. A white door casts a faint shadow. I'll do nothing. You stared at the door. Okay, well maybe it is here. Found a map. Open the headspace map. Amori, thank goodness you're here. Have you seen Basil? We can't find him anywhere. We should go tell Mari you're okay. She's been worried sick. Okay. I'd like to make some new toast, yes. Okay. Going out, Amori. Here's your allowance for today. Whoa, big cash! Thanks, Dad. Oh, hey. Eleven keys left.
I guess we'll go see Mari. I got a key, but which one? Amori, you're okay. Don't worry me like that. Where's Basil? Is that with you, Amori? No, I'm afraid not. The last thing I remember was sorting photos with Basil in his house. And next thing I know, I'm waking up in my neighbor's room with Aubrey and Kel. Or in neighbor's room. <laughs> At least we found you, Amori. I hope Basil's okay. Who's going to protect him if we're not there? Don't be such a downer, Aubrey. We'll find Basil for sure. You're absolutely right, Kel. It's at times like these when we gotta stay positive. Hmm. Why don't we go back to Basil's house? There may be something we missed. That's the spirit hero. And as always, I'll be here if you need me. Hey gang, still doing the same stuff? Oh, it looks like it. Oh, but now there's a floating mirror here, it seems. A floating mirror. Your friends smile warmly behind you. Okay. Oh, they're oh, they're laying down. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck are these over here? The grass sure feels nice here. Wanna join us, Amori? Yes. The stars shine brightly overhead. You don't have a care in the world. Amori learned observe. Whoa! Predicts who a foe will target next turn. Tonight's a perfect night for stargazing. <laughs> Hello, friends. Hold on, you got anything new? I got big, big money to spend. Nothing. flowers. They're already dying. We should do our best to take care of them until Basil gets back. Okay, hold on. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let me give him a squirt. Ugh. Okay, just that one though. Those are looking okay, I guess. Thanks, Steam, for that fucking blur down there. Hold on a second. Let me see if I can fix that, because that's going to be annoying. Uh, I'll be right back. Um, oops. Let's see. Steam. Steam. Uh... Okay, those are off, and then, oh, I have family mode on, so that's why I can't. Oh, thank God, someone told me how to use Steam. 
Oof. I only have a thousand games. <laughs> I just learned. Okay. In game. Mabel. Turn off those. And. Interface. Okay. I don't actually see any options for achievements, but there we go. Oh, maybe the other plants do need watering. Mm, maybe not. These look good. Yeah, it only seems like it's that one. picnic with my friends. Do you think Basil's okay? I feel like maybe we should be more worried. Hmm. His disappearance is concerning, but it won't help anyone to get too worked up over it. I guess. Basil's really trusting. He'll believe anything anyone says. What if someone tricked him into something? Or maybe he's fallen into a trap. Hey, calm down, Aubrey. I'm sure we'll find him. I know. Why don't you all water his flowers while he's away? I'm sure he'll be super thankful once he's back. <laughs> oh, Aubrey, come on. I don't like it when you cry. Cheer up. On the outside, Basil may seem really soft, but he's actually pretty strong on the inside. Basil can take care of himself. You should believe in him a little more. Well, when you put it that way... Okay, I'll try to believe in Basil. Thanks, Kel. Uh, don't smile at me, it's creepy. You're creepy. This was a great picnic. Didn't even talk to Mari. Oh well. seem to be anything out of the ordinary. Do you think Basil just left somewhere without telling us? I don't know. That doesn't sound like him. He's usually so considerate about these things. Guys, I'm really worried. Is there nothing we can do? What if we can't find him? What if he's in danger? Stay calm, Aubrey. I'm worried too, but that won't solve anything. Let's go look around the forest. Maybe he's wandered off and got lost. Yeah, cheer up, Aubrey. We'll find Basil. <laughs> you guys are right. Okay. We gotta keep our hopes up. Let's go look for Basil in the vast forest. What about this little stinky hole on the ground? Is that no one concerned about that? Okay. The fireplace is burning just as Basil left it. 
comfortable looking bed. I'm here to steal basil stuff. Small plants, sad. A bookcase, a little dusty. Ah. Uh. Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. Achoo! <laughs> oh! Tears, sorry. I don't know if I don't look around anymore. Fruits. I need my juices back. Hi, Mari. Come on, Amori. Have some fruit. Fruit's good for you. Yeah, okay. Any clue where the remaining 25 letters are? Well, in the alphabet. Where's the vast forest? Pinwheel forest. Well, that's different. A transportation station doesn't seem to be in service. This vast forest. More fruit to smash. And bunnies to also smash. Basil! Basil, where are you? I know. I bet my pet Rock will know what to do. Hector, be a good boy. Go find Basil. You tried your best, buddy. This is no time to fool around, Kel. Hey, why you... Hector was just trying to help. Let it go, you two. We need to keep ourselves focused. Mr. Parrot. Squawk. Pinwheel Forest. S squack, squack. Sorry, squack. Foggy Bridge. This is stronger than a regular or a dust bunny. Oh, Jesus. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, I'll be ready this time. Observe. Well, I think that's for the next round, not the current one, right? Probably could have killed it in one round, but yeah, so it doesn't matter. Oh, still hit pretty hard. seems a lot bigger since last time. Children aren't supposed to kill bunnies? We'll explain this then. Has a calming effect, removes emotion from a friend or foe. Time to be toast. <laughs> Ignores the fence when Amori sad. Oh, cool. I need to be sad then. friend dying? Maybe.
Some free jacks, I guess. Remember, I refuse. Thank you, though. Oh, I'm ready to fucking stab this happy bunny. Oh, I can't wait. Oh. Rebound deals damage to all foes. Okay. It's worth the two turns to set up a stab. Maybe if I did more damage on a critical hit, but it's about the same. so I can't go up there. Oh, hi again. Bye. Just a tire swing.
This is a pretty long ladder, huh? Uh, it's pretty tall. But not as tall as the one east of the stump. That one goes all the way up to space. <laughs> You're really afraid of heights, aren't you, Amori? It's okay. We don't have to look up there. Why not use the follow-ups? Well, I guess it depends on your power-ups. Yeah, if you have any good gameplay tips and you just want to, like, scream them at me, just send them to my email. I'll check them later. Super depressed. Yeah. What happens when I pass it to Aubrey? Okay. Keep cooking. Big bone. Candy. Oh. Big bone. Hold on, let me make sure we've got some juice. Can I sad poem out of combat? No, it's just changing skills.
Shelter. Small bone. Big bone. Nourishment. So if I pass to Mori, it always make him sad. So it's like an easy follow-up stab. I don't have to spend any tears on it. some grinding in, but, uh, I'm not sure where I need to go. I've only found the tire swing, the doghouse, the ladder that I cannot go up. Can I go this way? chance to stab him. Stab, stab, stab. Basil's in this forest. But we haven't even searched the whole forest yet. We can't stop now. Cheer up, Aubrey. We'll keep searching until we find him. If we don't find Basil soon, maybe we should meet up with Mari at the playground and figure out what to do from there. No, I'm gonna get this frickin' bee. Buh. Ten keys left. Between giant pinwheels. Underneath a wet pillow. Within a large frame. Yeah, I decoded it. It said, drink your Ovaltine. It was weird. Okay, bye.
The tentacles poking out of the ground. Okay, these are in a few places now. Wise Rock. Hi, I'm the Wise Rock. I give solid advice in exchange for clams. What kind of advice would you like me to give? Give me some bad advice, I guess. Understood. Here's your advice. Don't be ugly. I hope this helps. Thanks. I should see what happens when you pass the hero. Oh, my blood! <laughs> oh, no, wait! Oh, I hate that it defaults to the last skill that you used. Jeez, whoa. Bunny? Train station. Squat? Line starts here. Tater. We'll get up soon. Just give me a bit. H E L L O I A M T H E S P E L L I N G B E E E E E E E E E E, 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 E. Oh god. <laughs> I fucked up. <laughs> I can't stand talking to this bee guy. He's driving me nuts. Mom told me to put it on a jacket because she thought it was going to get cold. Hmm. It's so hot right now. But I don't want to take my jacket off because then I'd have to hold it. Hot. Diggity. Dog. It's me. Hot diggity dog. A lot of friends here. <laughs> I like that one. Ah, help! It's a day. It's an ugly plant creature. Excuse you. I'm no ugly plant creature. I'm a sprout mole, a very high functioning and intelligent creature. What you are referring to is a lost sprout mole. When sprout moles become lost, they can often become hostile and attack without warning. Hmm. Actually, where am I? Could it be that I'm lost? Um, suddenly, I don't feel so good. to hear at this time. Okay, just extra damage. There, he died. <laughs> I've only 
seen this train once, and that was years ago. Probably goes somewhere completely different now. When I wait too long, I get antsy. Gotta move, gotta move. Until the sign doesn't move soon, the guy next to me is gonna get it. It's a blessing to exist. La 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 la. My singing makes the time pass faster for me and slower for everyone else. I want to talk to this bush over here. I don't mind waiting at all. Waiting's just a natural part of life. I'm in need of fat stacks of cash. This long line is the perfect excuse for me to catch up on my beauty sleep. I always seem to find myself in precarious situations. I wonder if this counts. Chomp, chomp, chomp. I've been seeing some gator guys around here recently. That means the big boss is conducting business again. Huh? You haven't heard of the big boss? Well, you will soon. I spy with my little eye. A rainbow umbrella thing with lots of legs. Wizzy Whitney. Yeah, I'm pretty fast, but not as fast as a train. It's important to know your limits. Ah, blah. Jerko, can you tie the, tell the guy in front of me to hurry up? Some of us has lives, you know. Oh, we're at the lemonade. Oh, fuck, I thought this was the train line. <laughs> Howdy! Okay. I like to consider myself a pretty well-tempered jash. But if there's one thing I can't stand, it's line cutters. Gibbs, the stationary musician. Hi kids, it's Gibbs, the stationary musician. I used to be a traveling musician, but I left that life a long time ago. Would you be able to spare five clams? They would be a great help since I'm completely stationary. I'll show you something good if you do. Okay. Thank you for your donation. Now in return, let me play you the song of my people. thought the song was pretty good. I don't know, I like my clans back, thanks. Trains aren't really my thing. I'm just here for the music. I can't talk to the bees. Oh boy, I'm in trouble now. <sighs> Why does it always gotta be me? This ain't none of your business, kid. Be careful who you associate with. I'm speaking from experience here. You know what I hate more than anything else? Bunnies. That's right. Bunnies. I just hate them so much. If I had one wish in the world, it would be to destroy all the world's bunnies. Hey, what do you- You look like you've defeated a few bunnies. Yeah, that's right. I can tell how many bunnies you've defeated just by looking at you. That's how much I hate bunnies. Say, tell you what, let's make a deal. You defeat at least five bunnies, 
Come back and report to me. I'll give you something nice. Now go and destroy those bunnies. Hello, fellow bunny hater. By the look in your eyes, I can see that you've killed 11 bunnies. Splendid. I see you've destroyed more bunnies. That's 11 bunnies obliterated. Thank you so much, fellow bunny hater. Got a cotton ball. Oh, cool. Now go and destroy more bunnies. Can I get anything else for killing? You have to kill 14 more bunnies for your next prize. Now you- now get out there and destroy those bunnies. I'm on the way to conduct some important business. And then afterwards, I'll conduct more important businesses. Isn't the air nice here? You can smell the clean. Blukey gets down easily, but he just needs someone to listen sometimes. And that someone's me. Everyone here's so different and interesting. I wonder what makes me different and interesting. I gotta kill some fucking bunnies! It's okay. I think this is going to be kind of like an Undertale situation where there's just a few people that are just vigorously jerking off while they're watching the stream. And that's okay, I guess. I can't stab him. Where's the fucking picnics at? <laughs> Got tofu. Ugh. I do need to kill that bunny. But I also need to conserve my resources. Oh, the double bunny. They're both happy, too. I need a juice. Skill defeats a foe, gain bread. Oh, yo! I like bread. Let's 
Swat. Train station. Swat, swat. Foggy bridge. Where's the picnic? Ah, shoot. Guess I gotta go around. Bracelet. Create bread for three days. That sounds great. I wish I could be making bread. All these secret melons. Life jam. Cherry soda. There's just too many things here. Why is there so much stuff here? What the fuck? Oh, danger bunny. Uh... I don't have enough to stab it. you doing bunny uh, it's fine i guess a three leaf clover is that a charm A fluffy ball of cotton. Just a regular clover. Luck plus three. Simple bracelet. but is very shy. He's a good friend. I guess I'll replace Hector. <laughs> this looks like shiny knife can never be replaced. Banana smoothie. I might just have to start using my items. Oh, I've, been, I've gone in a big circle. Bunnies! You have to kill 10 more bunnies for your next prize. Okay. Oh wait, there's a little hidey hole down there. What was that? I don't remember what that was. Oh, two sad bunnies.
All right, I need more juice. Wait, won't, oh! I guess I'm fighting a tree. <laughs> <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> Sorry, tree. I didn't mean it. Oh no, oh, we're good. So what is calling from Hero do? Got a little bit of health. to all friends. 40% of heart. 30. 25% of juice. We'll hold on to that. Oh, plum juice is not great. Hard bulb. You can hear something struggling inside. Hmm. Okay. Wait, can I cross this? No. that do? Okay, that one just turned into an attack again. I don't need to stab him. I really want to, but I don't need to. Careful. Because I don't want to be sad with the sprout around. Or I'll kick my ass.
Passing two heroes in AoE. Okay. Oh yeah, dang. That's pretty good. Two bunnies left, okay. Before I do that, though... Let's go back to the playground, because I didn't realize how close we were, and that it looped. Give me some of that candy. Hello, everyone! How's it going? Have you found Basil yet? Hey, Mari. No luck so far, I'm afraid. Oh. I'm sorry, guys. I wish there was a way I could help more. We're all doing our best. Maybe we should start looking outside this forest. I know! Why don't we try climbing the really long ladder? The one east of the stellum. We can't do that. Amori's afraid of heights. But what if Basil's somewhere up there? We gotta take our chances. I know. But... Amori! You're growing stronger and stronger every day. You can handle climbing a ladder, can't you? Come on, little brother. Face your fears. It's natural to be nervous at first, but you should know that we all believe in you. Come on, Amori. It's just one measly little ladder. What's the worst that can happen? I don't know about this. Do you think you're gonna be okay, Amori? Yeah, sure, whatever. I'll be fine. Okay! If you're okay with it, then I'm okay too. But if you get scared, you can always count on me to back you up. <laughs> Thanks, Amori. You've got some real courage. 
Woohoo! Let's go, let's go to the ladder east of this dump. No, after we gotta kill some more rabbits. Uh, see you, Mari. I don't remember. When I... Bye now. Stay safe. Remember, Amori, you're stronger than you think. Give me the fucking candy. Which one's Amori? The black and white one. Stab, stab, stab. Well, I guess we could save our juice. Maybe not worth stabbing. This isn't where the train station is. Gotta get out of there. That's okay, Mori's comfortable being sad. <laughs> Hello, fellow bunny hater. By the look in your eyes, I can see that you've killed 25 bunnies. Splendid. I see you've destroyed more bunnies. That's 25 obliterated. Thank you so much, fellow bunny hater. You got bunny ears. Uh, okay. Now go and destroy more bunnies. How many more? 25. Oh, we need 50 now. <laughs> Put the bunny ears on. Speed plus 12s. It helps you hear better. Oh, they're so fast. Well, no, hold on. Let me change this around because I don't want Amori being any faster than Kel. Speed 23, yeah, let's change that back. safe to leave. Oh no! I kind of just want to kill all the bunnies. But I don't want to be too powerful. Twenty-five more bunnies. That's not a bunny. Don't waste my fucking time.
What's 24 more bunnies? more for this one. I don't know why it bothered. Because I want to do less damage, I guess. up the clams. Holy shit. Um, where's the biggest group of bunnies? I think if I just go through here. two groups and exiting the scene is probably the fastest way to kill a bunch of bunnies. busy holding his knife to grab a ball. Only got two. a little bit. Oh no. I missed the other bunny. What does passing the do? Is that also an AoE? Self-help guide. Use. This is a thing I refuse to read. Uh, follow-ups. Okay, we'll start with Kel. Pass to Amori. Sad. Pass to Aubrey. 
knocks it out of the park and deals damage to a random foe. Okay. It seemed to be about the same amount though, so that's weird. Um. Okay, passes from hero. Kel calls Kel, Kel attacks, then Hero heals 50% of Kel's heart with words of encouragement. Aubrey attacks, same thing. Amori, same deal. Okay. Well, that one's a little more straightforward. To Amori, tries to get Amori to notice her, so she makes a strong attack on the same foe. Pester's Aubrey makes her angry. Encourages Aubrey, making her happy and increasing her defense. Again, trip. Aims for a low attack and reduces target foe's speed. And then attack again and just attacking once more. Okay. Oops. And collective shimmer twins. Uh, three, release, ten. One for every time a foe deals damage to a friend. Okay. All good. Let's kill more rabbits. Bunny genocide. Um, has anyone kept track of how many we've killed? <laughs> I guess I can go talk to the rabbit. So it's not a big deal, but... 35. Whoa. Okay. Almost there. All the double bunny.
Oh, yeah. Oh, that was a lot of damage. Hit it right in the heart with ball. <laughs> I think we're at 39. No, maybe. Yeah. Here, let me see what counter does. All foes target Aubrey for one turn. If Aubrey is attacked, she attacks. Oh, that's useful. Oh, that's- I'm healing the wrong person. Oh well, it's dead. Grinding to become the thing I hate the most. What the fuck is a sprout? Get out of here. Five more. Let's count in the bloodlust again. Um, let's double check. 48. Two more. No more.
Alright, I hope it was worth it. Hello, fellow, fellow bunny haters. By looking in your eyes, I see you've killed 50 bunnies. Splendid! See, you've destroyed more bunnies. That's 50 obliterated. Thank you so much, fellow bunny hater. Got a rabbit's foot. Now go and destroy more bunnies! I have nothing more to ask of you. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> Very fast and lucky foot. Shoot. doesn't even have a charm. Okay, now I gotta get to a picnic basket without dying. Oh. No more bunnies. Never again. Healed and there we go. Hey, how's it going? Give me just a minute. I'm gonna take a quick break, get up, walk around, uh, make sure I'm not dead, and I'll be right back. Thank you. 
Hi friends, I'm back. I brought you a delicious chocolate truffle. I hope you will enjoy it. I'm shoving it into the USB port right now. Mmm. Yeah, I hope you got it. Okay, I'm free from killing bunnies for a little bit. Thank God. Oh, I have a new quest, though. Grumble, grumble. Grumble, grumble, grumble. Hey, Van. Is something wrong with Beryl? She seems a little, uh, upset. Oh, uh, about that. Well, you see... Oh, I forgot the screen. Oh! Thanks for the heads up. I might have double clicked it. You missed the coolest scene in the fucking game. Dang it. Oh, well. <sighs> Let me explain. Look at this pole. Can you believe it? What are we looking at? Yeah, I don't see it. Exactly. The tetherball's missing. Van here used his arms and swung too hard. Now the ball's gone far off somewhere. Never to be seen again. I told you not to use your arms, Van. You gotta use your head. Like this. Sorry, Barrel. Using my head all the time gives me a headache. That's because you don't have a hard head like I do. Oh, uh, something just hit me. I'm sure I saw the ball flying off somewhere in that direction. But it's <laughs> into the vast forest? Ugh. We'll never find it now. It might as well be lost forever. Hey, don't sweat it, Barrel. We'll go look for the ball for you. <laughs> you sure you want to do that? Vast Forest is a pretty dangerous place, you know. One time, I even got into a super grisly brawl with this ugly plant creature with dead empty eyes and a gaping mouth. I outwitted it, of course, being cool and smart and all. There's no monster in all the universe that can outrun me. Blah ha ha ha! Say, Amori, why don't you and your friends go with Beryl and keep her out of trouble? I go myself, but... Van! I don't remember happy. Browse ran over Banks again! <laughs> oh jeez, there's my cue. I'm coming, Happy. Be safe out there, you guys. I'll see you when you get back. Um, mix and match the artist that made my theme. Uh, which one? What are you talking about? Oh, the my like intro music that was too mellow. Come on, Barrel. Let's go find your lost ball. We don't have anything to worry about as long as we're together. <laughs> sure. Just don't get in my way when I show off my totally amazing headbutt skills. Ugh. Let's just get this over with. Hello, Cursor. Bear will join your party. Oh, cool! Oh, well, somewhere. And I guess they can't be interacted with. Alright, well, <laughs> this is as far as they pointed us. I don't think that went this way, but. Back into the forest they go. I guess we'll go to the pinwheel sign.
Just give him another stab. Didn't see the headbutt. Where's the headbutt at? Yeah, 32 seems kind of low for it being a random hit. This game is right next to an H game on the Steam popular releases. Is it the, the Fuda game? That's been showing up on my list for a while now. <laughs> That's the one, okay. <laughs> popular game on scene. Yeah, it's been up there for a while now. <laughs> Doing that big AoE damage. It must be like a percentage increase. It's so low right now. Maybe later it'll be better. I might go back to the... the Blossom. Is that in this area? This whole forest looks the same. But I guess there's no dog. Yeah. That was weird. I didn't think Amori would target randomly with. Attack again. It's always been the same thing. Here's in there randomly. Whoa. Oh, hey. Would you like to pet the dog? <laughs> I guess so, yeah. You pet the dog. Felt something in your hand. You got rubber band. Oh, cool. Is that a charm? That's not a charm. Not a toy. Deals damage to a foe and reduces their defense.
achievement pop up still broken. Life jam. Whoa. No dog this time. <laughs> or maybe he's just behind the leaves. Let me see. No. It's kind of random when he shows up. Rubber band. Okay. Yummy. I'll eat that. Does the color mean anything? So like their base color? No. Sometimes they'll have an aura around them that changes with their emotions. Oh hey, here's the ladder. Or a ladder. I don't think that's the one that I need to go to though. I think they were talking about the other ladder. Okay, not here. Yeah, I gotta get over to the other map again. Too lost here. <laughs> Um, if they're red, they're angry. If they're blue, they're sad. If they're yellow, they're happy. Um, if there's nothing, they're neutral. I think it was down here. That's where I found it. Right now it doesn't matter too much because I've kind of out-leveled these grinding too much. Oh, there's- there's ball on the ground right there. But I'm here anyways. Hard bulb, you can hear something struggling inside. So I figured that out. Sweet, there's my lost ball! Yoink! Finally! Let's take this bad boy back to the playground. I'm itching to play some tether ball. Okay. Yoink. Can use the knife on the ball. Uh, I don't think so. It's the same button you press to interact with, or just to talk to something. This just goes back over here. So we need to go all the way around again. Just run. I don't think the experience here is worth it.
Well, that was fun. Not? I'm gonna play some tetherball. See you later, alligators. I'm out of here. But seriously, come see me before you go. I got something special for you. Let me save the game and then I have to fix that fucking achievement thing in the corner. Okay, let's see if I can fix it. Oh, I fixed it. <laughs> cursor right down here. Hey dudes, thanks for getting my lost ball back. As you can see, I'm putting it to good use. Yep, sure is. I was thinking, since you were also kind to help me out, I'm gonna be generous and teach you my special skill. But first, I got a question for y'all. Which of you has the hardest head? Well, duh, that have to be Aubrey. What did you just say? Whoa, chill out. No hard feelings. Get it? <laughs> that sounds about right. All right, Aubrey. I'm going to teach you a skill just between hard-headed folk like us. It's my specialty, head butt. It's, re it's simple, really. You just run up to someone and... Wham! Now you try. That looks like it would hurt. And also mess up my hair. And also ruin my bow. Ah, <laughs> come on, Aubrey. Live a little. Having messy hair never hurt anyone. Hero is living proof of that. <laughs> yeah, you bet. Hmm, fine. But if I'm doing this, I'm gonna give it all I got. Whoa. Ugh. I feel dizzy. Whoa, nice one, Aubrey. I knew I saw talent in you. Congratulations. You passed the test with flying colors. Huh? What's happening? From this day forth, I hereby declare you a bona fide headbutter. Aubrey learned headbutt. And now, take this certificate. Show your friends. I'm sure they'll be proud. You got a butt certificate. Important is that an, in the butt certificate proof Aubrey has a hard head. There it is. Why are we starting with the ladder that goes to space and not the smaller ladder? That seems like a good one to start with. Oh well. <laughs> Remember what Mari said, Amori. You're stronger than you think. Don't worry, we'll be right behind you. Yeah, and if you fall, we'll be right here to catch you. Kel, don't scare him. You won't fall, Amori. I promise. You're no longer afraid of heights. Oh, okay, that was easy. I guess I could go to the other one now, huh? Man, I know there's a reason we've never climbed this ladder, but I can't put my finger on it. It's on the tip of my tongue. Oh well. Here goes nothing. <laughs> 
Oh, wait, hold up, guys. Shoot. Where is he? I just had him. Where's who? Hector, my pet rock! I swear I just had him in my pocket. No! Hector! He must have fallen out of my pocket when I wasn't paying attention. I'm sorry, Hector. I should have been more careful. What's the big deal? It's just a rock, right? How dare you say that? He's not just a rock, he's family. Don't worry, I'm sure he'll turn up soon, Cal. Probably. I sure hope so. Wait for me, Hector. I'll find you. I promise. First, how oh, that happened. <laughs> the ladder, it's just never ends. <laughs> Whoa, that's one st small step for Kel and one large step for Kel kind. That's not how it goes. You don't get to decide how it goes. You weren't here first. Wait, hold on. Is that my butt certificate? Take that down right now. What if somebody sees it? <laughs> no way. Look at this thing fluttering in the wind. So majestic. So beautiful. Hero, do something! <laughs> One sec. Just, uh, catch in my breath. Actually, give me a minute. Never mind. So majestic. Cheep. Other world campsite. Cheep, cheep. Cat. Cattail fields. I'm going to the campsite. Time like this that I am reminded that our universe is beautiful. So many humans today. You guys really are you guys are always such big fans of space travel. Yeah, Zarf. Vending machine. A tasty soda for a hundred clams. Uh I kind of want to see what's at the other ladder. I think I'm going to go back first. Bye. Thank you. 
yeah, there's two ladders. I can't remember. Which side is it on? Was that on this side? Yeah, I think that was on this side. No. I refuse. No more violence. Forest. Why this pinwheel no spin? And there's the sea. Yo, look at that fucking hat! Is that for me? Or is it gonna kill me? I'm not sure. <laughs> Keys left. Mm, it's not for me. <laughs> it's just there. Oh, hey, Mari. Hey, Mori! Fancy seeing you all the way up here. The wind here is stronger than it is on the ground. I wonder why that is. Seems like the perfect weather to fly a kite. Bro, I don't want fruits again. I played Lisa, I played Lisa the Joyful, and then I played some other Lisa thing. I don't remember what it was, though. Picnic, yeah. <laughs> ah, my ears popped again! Ah, uh, yeah. That tends to happen with the elevation. <laughs> what? Did you say something? <laughs> I- I said... Your ears popped. Because of the elevation. Shh, keep it down. It's not just us here. Can't you see that boy with his kite? He looks like he's concentrating really hard. Oops. Sorry, kite kid. stares at his kite in deep concentration. Do you want to disturb him? Of course I do. I'm just a boy with his kite. We may not look like much, but we have an unbeatable bond. That's not something just anyone would understand. We'll show you how strong we are when we work together. Oh fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Which one, which one do I fight first? Hold on, let me, t let me take some steps back here. Let's start with this sad poem. And then... Counter. I'm gonna hold on to my power for now. I figure out what the fuck's going on here. I have a lot of health. Okay. <clears throat>
Uh-oh. <laughs> Ooh. Repairs Kinskai. Oh no. <laughs> I've made mistakes. Now I'm going to stab him. No, I don't want to do that. Especially when I'm sad. Oh, that doesn't depress you? Oh. Twenty juice to all friends. <laughs> well,
thing I just saved. <laughs> Yeah. Wait, do I want to? I think I just... I don't know if this is any different from... Reloading. Just to be safe? No. I'll load my game. mirror over here. Deals big damage, but Aubrey also takes damage. Stronger when Aubrey is angry. Okay. <laughs> okay, hopefully they're just slower than us now, so we might be able to pull off some heals. Alright, see ya, have a good night. Let me bank this up. I want to see how much damage Headbutt does.
67, fuck! Oh. No, this can't be. The winds. It's getting weaker. Oh, we're close. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, I wasted that. Ah, oh, fuck. Library of Runa? Uh, maybe when it's done. here after we get some stuff. But yeah, I don't think I'll go back to the Library of Runa until it's done. Oh, I didn't know there were enemies up here. I don't know if this game got released on any consoles yet. It's, as far as I know, it's only on PC at the moment. I feel that there's probably a, a Switch version soon. It was pretty good when I played it. There's a lot of grinding. At the time when I was playing it, the game was changing like day to day. And I didn't want to invest a lot of time into grinding out new decks for my characters. It didn't seem worth it.
Let me go see what the mailbox man has now. Yeah, at the time, they were even still like balancing cards for all the new stuff that was coming out and everything would just keep changing day to day and it was not very fun to come back and see that all of your work has been wasted on a set of cards that got nerfed. Uh, ooh. Okay. I think that's gonna be good for now. I think we'll stop here and I'll continue sometime soon. It's an early access game? Well, yeah. That's probably why it's changing day to day. That doesn't make it fun to play. Anyways, I'll see you friends. Have a good one. I'll catch you next time.